What kind of plugins are these? These plugins are called uh, Deskbank. We also call them Studio Toolkits. So whenever I use the word Deskbank or Toolkit, I'm actually talking about the plugins for Adobe Illustrator. Okay, um, we have different toolkits. We have a toolkit for boxes. We have one for labels, for flexible, and for shrink. So there's four different toolkits available. And then last but not least, we're also going to talk about an amazing program called Visualizer, allowing you to visualize product right inside the retail store, so virtual mockups. Okay. Design companies nowadays need to diversify. And um, skeleton crews with just a few designers, you know, have to do everything, uh, are pretty common, right? Sounds familiar. Uh, people don't have time to learn these complicated uh, programs, structural design programs. So when you think of 3D software, you immediately think of uh, complicated programs with hundreds and hundreds of buttons. Well, guess what? The plugins that I'm going to show you today are very, very easy to learn, right? So if you think of uh, Cinema 4D, the nice gentleman that had the session here before me, uh, if I look at that program, wow, that's amazing what you can do with that, but wow, you know, how long does it take you to learn that program, right? Uh, personally, I don't have the time for that, so maybe you don't have either, but you still want to have a nice three-dimensional mock-up, digital mock-up that you want to create. So uh, we'll show you how we do that. It's very easy, it shortens your total production time, and it also avoids costly mistakes that might happen in your production process. Have a look at this one here. This is a can food, dog food. Okay. Um, now, just FYI, I want to make this absolutely clear. This is a horror story from a customer who was not using our plugins. After this happened, they actually purchased our plugins. And in order to protect the innocent, or you know whatever you want to call it, um, I actually changed the product. So this is not the product it happened to, and I will not reveal the name of the customer either because it's kind of embarrassing. Okay, this is what happened. They created